All right, guys. In this video, I have a 2016 uh, Jeep Cher Cherokee, and the issue with this one is that the odometer is flashing. So let's go up. Let's go ahead. We're gonna pull up the trusted hotel. We'll see what we can uh, we can find. We'll do an auto scan. We'll go through this. Let it do its auto scan and then I'll bring you guys right back. Alright, so everything just finished uh, going through. We're going to go to uh, report real quick. Uh, let's see what the codes are. Uh, so we have an ECU config configuration mismatch and not configured. Uh, battery voltage above threshold, battery voltage below threshold. So those ones are not, I'm worried about these ones up here. So we have a configuration mismatch. So uh, we might be able to configure it with the hotel. If I'm not mistaken, I did this before with the hotel. We actually, was actually able to do a configuration. So uh, door module missing calibration. I'm not worried about that, that's stored. So we'll back up real quick. Uh, we'll go into the BCM. Might be under special functions. Uh, system check, ECU configure information. Let's click on that. I did this once before onto a vehicle. I couldn't. Re I can't remember which one it is. I think I can't see it. Okay. Uh, we'll go to configure. There it is. If I'm not mistaken, this was the one. The proxy configuration alignment. Uh, we're going to take and we are going to turn the car off real quick. We'll put it in the run position. Oh, turn that off. Copyright infringement. So uh, we're going to press OK on this one. Must be in the run position. We're good. I'm going to turn off the AC. the door so we can stop that get my finger out of the way please continue to realign the following you see use the PC PDM we'll see how everything goes after this I remember this was about two three years ago has been done. Please close the procedure, switch the ignition off, shut all doors, unplug the diagnostic tool from the DC. Wait, bus to go to sleep after the bus is asleep. Wait two minutes, then you can reconnect the tool and rerun the proxy configuration to see the new proxy status of all ECUs. Okay, so what we're going to do is just turn this off real quick. We're going to open the door. We're going to do like it said. We're going to close the door. I'm going to pause you guys and I'll bring you guys right back. All right, so let's take and turn the ignition back on. We'll start the car. And we'll see if it still flashes. I'm hoping not. And there we go. So uh, basically what ends up happening is that if you have modules that are replaced onto these vehicles and um, all you do is just replace them and you don't configure them and you don't align them into their, into their proper spots um, electronically, uh, what ends up happening is that you have a code that will be set that says that there is a configuration mismatch. Now, all that means is that you have to realign the module in its proper position onto the bus. And then after that, you're able to take and the system will work properly. So as you can tell, that's what happened here. So uh, this was a quick video. I thought it was going to be a little bit longer, but I hope you guys enjoyed it anyway. And I will see you guys next time.